Jessica Henderson came from the UK in March 2004. When she was 35, her husband had gotten a job in the US Lincoln. He was born in Southampton, England, which is 70 miles from the capital of City London. And it is 14 miles from the US City of Portsmouth. She had only left with the child, Samuel, who was born in the UK. And his well, family members did not come with her and had been in different places at the time. Her brother was in Singapore at the time and her mother and father were in France. When she came to the US, she was not educated and she stayed in London and the door was there. She said it was a weird to leave the place where she had lived her whole life with only a suitcase for her valuables. She said it was very hard because she had become a mother and had no friends in the country. It was hard to make the shift, she said. It was also tough to make herself happy and give her first challenge. It was a very different life from when she was in her country. There were many things she had never even seen in her life. She had come to the US by plane and had been in New York City. She says when I moved to Scottsdale, I didn't want to go back to England, but living in the city for the first time was stuck. She knew no one when she came out of her husband, and people think, oh, the language was an easy transition because the two languages are very alike. The first day she had arrived in the city, she had gotten two visitors from her family that evening. It was very hard to know what one day, and they never knew if they were going to find friends or people that would help them. There was a very different education system for the UK folks. It took a while to get in touch with her family and to set up her home. She had to rent furniture or roll her furniture from her old mother's apartment. It took a few months for the furniture to reach them and a few days for them to set it up. She didn't even have a car when she came here. Though she had some struggles with her arrangement of her apartment. Her son did have the advantage of new schools. She was surprised at the size of New York and had never expected how big it actually was. As stated before, she was not educated about the US and the size of the US. She was amazed when she saw the actual size of New York. There were many different cultures and diverse races in New York and England. Not many cultures were in the world where she lived before. Mommy and Mommy was a really surprised and two children, children Sebastian and Sam. She said she is happy living in Scottsdale. She says it reminds her of where she used to live, even though the roads and houses are good. The entire contents of a household in the UK was shipped by an international moving com company that day before she left. It mainly contained clothes and toys. This was all shipped by plane. However, the rest of the belongings were transported by a shipping container, which mostly held computers and furniture, which arrived a few months after they had arrived. She and her son had spent the night in a hotel with then flew to the US the next day. The flight was 8 hours and they arrived at 10 p.m. on March 31st, 2004.